Welcome back. It's time for the gig list where during this pandemic we've been telling you about how to help the local music scene today a space to grow the industry here for those who find the oh so important behind the scenes work pretty interesting. Would you listen to that? The editor not even old enough to drive, but curious as ever. Some people are creatives, so this is an opportunity for the creatives to come out, get involved. Get involved in these classes at Powderhorn Park. Timothy Wilson is the co-owner of the entertainment company Urban World Management that is helping to get these students to understand how the music industry all comes together. We're talking engineering, music production, videography. The behind the scenes people make great livings. The behind the scenes people are very important to what you do on TV, what happens on radio, what happens on the set of a movie, uh, you know, behind the orchestra, in the recording studio. This is one class of a couple now being offered Monday through Thursday for those 12 to 20 years old. How do you make it longer? With instructors who know their stuff. People have produced records, have had records out themselves, engineered sound for uh, uh major recording artists have done things on that level. Classes like these with state of the art equipment could cost you a pretty penny to use, but in this case it is all free. I repeat free. Kids get to participate and have the same quality of experience as kids who are are paying for for similar programs. And so I think this can be somewhat of an equalizer. It's in partnership with the Minneapolis Parks and Recreation Board. You might be thinking Parks and Rec? Yes, the department says it's for those kids who don't find themselves, let's say, dominating the court. We want to reach the kids who say that's not my thing but this could be. And so I think this is another way of us saying, we hear you community, we hear you young people, and we want to make space for you. And who knows, they might be editing a music video. Welcome back, it's time for the gig list. Or even a story like this made for TV soon enough. Yeah, this is the first of four creative spaces the Minneapolis Parks launched. They're still looking for young people interested in enrolling in this one at Powderhorn Park. But of course, it is a pandemic, so there is limited space. We've got a link to more information on this story at care11.com. Yeah, the next three spaces are thinking about one, maybe like architectural design. Oh, so, cool. Pretty cool. Yeah, very cool. OK, guys, sunny.